who's wearing what and who sat with who. Um, I think it's been incredibly disrespectful to the Queen and Philip that making this whole thing about uniforms and standing positions. You know, Prince Philip was an amazing individual. He did so much for this country, and I think uh, everyone's getting very distracted with 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 other other press. Do you think you know the bloke? Will it have bothered him that he couldn't wear his uniform? Would he, noting as you rightly say that his grandfather was such a proud military bloke, would it have upset? Would it have upset Harry? What's your view on that? No, I, I think you know Harry served his country and he's made the sacrifice. He doesn't need a uniform to express that, and so did his, his grandfather. And um, they're both proud military men, and that's one of the things they both had in common. They both served in the military and both served in combat. Lastly, noting I don't think I've spoken to my friends that much about my grandfather, so I really can't push record video. Start the relationship between Martin's Harry video. and the Duke. Were they close possibly because of the military bonds and Harry losing his mum? Yes, of course. Yeah. I, I think there was a lot of, uh, they were very close. They're both similar individuals, you know, very charismatic, both have a sense of humour. I think Harry's and Eugene's personal uh, message really brought that out about uh, Prince Philip behind closed doors. Thanks for your time. Dean Stoddy, the friend of Prince Harry, author and former British Special Forces soldier. Events such as funerals.